taken by Fiore, Tenno is in there, and that's a good header too! What a start! It was a dream start for Argyle, but few expected to see a carbon copy repeat just 20 minutes later. Ooh. Terrible clearance, it's put Leicester defence in all kinds of trouble. The header! Yes! 2-0 then, and it should have been three just before the break, following this appalling back pass from Oldfield. But Fiore just couldn't believe his good luck and fluffed a golden chance. Oh, what a dreadful mistake by Oldfield! And Fiore with an open goal, tried to put it round. Plymouth should have started the second half full of confidence, but they were strangely devoid of both ideas and motivation after the break, conceding the midfield to a Leicester side who certainly made the most of it. The visitors scored their first when Robbie Turner's attempted clearance looped over his own keeper. Then they made sure of their point 15 minutes later. We're we right then. Lobs it in again. And it's in! Well, that goal's been coming for about 10 minutes. Goal scorer Steve Thompson with that chip over the top of the Argyle defence. It's now Argyle 2, Leicester City 2. The end of January saw a continuation of improvement in Plymouth's league form. A Marshall hat-trick at Barnsley confirmed 18th spot for the home park club. However, FA Cup interest was short-lived with a 5-0 defeat at Bristol Rovers. Argyle entered February looking to consolidate their recent up.